The Amphar Gala just took place in Venice and we have to see what the celebs are wearing. Bella Thorne and she's giving me 90s vibes. That little black choker, a little bit of mesh at the bottom of her dress. I think this is a really good look on her. Um, I know Bella Thorne's a little bit more bold in her looks, but I think this was definitely a nice fit. Carla Bruni and Saint Laurent, honestly, I love when they wear anything by Saint Laurent. Everything is kind of kept to a minimal, and I think it's very intentional just because the dress kind of speaks for itself with its simplicity and kind of that idea of less is more, and I think this is a perfect example. I think she looks really fabulous. Camila Mendes in Miu Miu, and honestly, I feel like the little black accents really kind of edge up the look just a little bit because it's very soft with like the floral print on a white gown. And so those little black accents kind of come out of nowhere, but I actually think they are just the perfect touch. Sylvia Braz in Roberta Cavalli, and honestly, this beautiful colored gown, and then look at that buckle it almost looks like a really big belt buckle it's like turquoise and silver and I, I just kind of want to take off the necklace because I feel like those little accents are more than enough even the bracelets I don't think they're necessary just because when you have pieces that kind of look like jewelry already on the gown that's more than enough Rafa Kalaman in Saint Laurent hers is similar to Carla Brunny's, but hers has, you know, the little hooded detail, which I absolutely love. I just think there's something so beautiful about it. Um, I think she looks really, really gorgeous. And again, you want to keep everything pretty simple. Another Saint Laurent moment. This is Thaisa Navas, and this gown was worn on many at the Venice Film Festival. It was a very popular gown. I could see why. It's a gorgeous black gown. I really love that she has her sunglasses, some jewels. I don't know. I think it's just really elegant and sexy. Okay, Rita Ora's gown is definitely unique and different. Has this really long chiffon train. Um, I'm not sure about this kind of added detail. I don't know if I think it's necessary. I'm sure I would like to see it from a different angle, um, but I think the chiffon was really beautiful and kind of like the little, um, just like the jewelry details, even at the waist, you can kind of see it underneath. And I think it's really beautiful, but that little, that little added detail is kind of throwing me off, but maybe I just need to see it from a different angle. Mila Jovovich in Prada. I actually really like the gown. I think the gown, I love that ruching effect. That's a very flattering effect, but I think it's just a really pretty gown. I think the earrings are a nice touch. Um, I love the color and the details of it all. I'm into it. Michelle Rodriguez, I'm not mad at the gown. I just wish the hair and makeup would have come through. I don't know, the hair is a little messy. The makeup is just, not there um i would have liked to have seen her glam up just a little bit more because she is wearing this beautiful gown and i don't know the hair and makeup are just kind of a miss for me leona lewis is a vision in red she is this red kind of mermaid silhouette looks so good on her the sleeves have just this beautiful detail that red lip a vision kate beckinsale was like i'm just gonna steal the show I really am. I'm going to steal the show in this super dramatic gown, show a little leg. Yeah, and she did. Luke Evans looking super dapper. Love the look. Jesse Williams also looking very handsome. I think the men looked great. Dying to know if you had a fave. If so, let's chat in the comments.